Can your business save up to 179% by using only the security products that Microsoft include in their 365 plans? Well, find out in today's video. But before we start, my name is Jonathan Edwards, helping you and your business with everything Microsoft 365. If you haven't already, check out 365gearsystem.com. Now I talk a lot on my YouTube channel about going all in with Microsoft and using all of the security products that they've got in their Microsoft 365 plans rather than buying lots of third party tools. Now someone sent me a LinkedIn message this week asking me, well if people do go all in with Microsoft, how much money would you save? And that is what today's video is all about. Now before we start comparing, let's look at the rules of the game. Most businesses use one of two products for Microsoft 365. There's Microsoft 365 Business Standard, which costs £9.40 per user per month. There's also Microsoft 365 Business Premium, which costs £16.60 per user per month. Now, Microsoft 365 Business Standard contains all of the collaboration tools that your business needs. You'll have an email address. You'll have file storage with OneDrive. You'll also have things like Microsoft Teams and you'll be able to install Microsoft Office on all of your devices. Now when it comes to Microsoft 365 Business Premium, well this contains a lot of the security features to help protect your business. I like to think of the difference between Business Standard and Business Premium really is security. So what are we going to be comparing today? Well, I know a lot of businesses who buy Microsoft 365 Business Standard and then buy lots of third party tools to help keep the business secure. What I'm saying is every business should buy Microsoft 365 Business Premium and use all the products within there and throw those third party tools out the window. So the difference in price between Business Premium and Business Standard is £7.20 per user per month. So keep that figure in your mind when we start comparing the third party products. And at the end of the video, we'll do a bit of a tally up. So the first security tool I want to talk about is email security. Now with every mailbox in Microsoft 365, you get something called Exchange Online Protection. With Microsoft 365 Business Premium, you get a more advanced product called Defender for Office 365. Now Defender for Office 365 is just as good as any third party tool out there and it's included with Business Premium. Now I see a lot of businesses buying a third party email security tool and one of these will cost you around £2.50 per user per month. The next security product I want to talk about is email archiving. Now there are some businesses out there who need to archive all of their emails sent and received for compliance purposes. However, I think every business should archive emails. Email is such an important communication tool, so it's important that you as a business keep all the emails sent and received, just in case you need to refer back to them in the future. Now, email archiving is part of Microsoft 365 Business Premium, but I see a lot of businesses buying third-party tools, tools like Mimecast or MailStore. Now, let's have a look at MailStore. A MailStore license will cost you about £3.50 per user per month. The next security feature I want to talk about is antivirus software. Now we'll all agree that every device in your business needs security software installed. This helps protect you against malware and ransomware to name but a few. Now most businesses that I see go out and buy a third party antivirus software solution. Something like Sophos, ESET or Bitdefender. And this will cost you about £2 per user per month. The next security tool that I want to talk about is called Endpoint Detection and Response, or EDR for short. Now, we live in a world where simply installing antivirus on our computers isn't enough. Cyber attacks have become more sophisticated, so we need more sophisticated software to protect us. And that is where EDR software comes in. Now, there are lots of third-party companies who provide EDR software, but it's included in Microsoft 365. 
Now, if you go down the third party route, you'll be spending about five pounds per user per month. Now, the next security tool we're gonna to talk about is multi-factor authentication, or MFA for short. We all need MFA to help protect us against 99.9% .9 of identity cyber attacks. Now, MFA is built into Microsoft 365, but I've seen a lot of companies using third-party products. Products like Duo. Now, I acknowledge that Duo is a more advanced product than the multi-factor authentication tool that is built into Microsoft 365. Duo can help protect your computer logon with MFA, for example. But again, I'm seeing a lot of businesses who are using Duo when they could be using just Microsoft MFA, which is free. And Duo will cost you about £2.50 per user per month. The next security tool that I want to talk about is hard drive encryption software. Now, encrypting your computer hard drive is really important, especially for portable devices. It means if that device is lost or stolen, it means that the data on that hard drive will not be able to be accessed, so it helps protect your company data. Now, there is some encryption software already built into Windows that's free, but I've seen businesses buying third-party encryption software. Software from Sophos or Bitdefender or ESET. This will cost you about a pound per user per month. Now the final security tool that we're going to talk about is vulnerability management. Now this has been a bit of a tough one because there's not a lot of products in the marketplace that offer monthly pricing for vulnerability management. What I've seen in small businesses is that a lot of them just don't do it, which is a mistake. Usually when companies want to do it, it might be for compliance purposes. And what they'll do is they'll contract a third party cybersecurity consultant to do it on a consultancy basis. But one tool that I have found is called Intruder and they do vulnerability management on a monthly basis. Now the prices vary depending on how many devices you have in your business. But for 50 devices, this will cost you £3.54 per device per month. So the results are in. I hope you've been keeping track of all those numbers. If you haven't, here they are. If your business bought all of the third party security products that I've talked about in this video, you would spend £20.04 on those products per user per month compared with only £7.20 by subscribing to Microsoft 365 Business Premium. Now, I understand that not every business watching this video will subscribe to all those third-party security tools, but they're all available in Microsoft 365. Plus, in Microsoft 365, you've got some other tools that aren't available in third-party scenario. Things like conditional access, data loss prevention, and sensitivity labels. So according to my calculations, if your business uses Microsoft 365 Business Premium, you can have access to a host of security products, plus you might save about 179% on security software. Now, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's given you food for thought. I look forward to seeing you again soon.